Hey guys, I wanted to give you a real quick training note. First and foremost, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, depending on where you're watching this from. Um, but I wanted to talk with you about one of the key principles that I want you to adopt as, uh, as you begin to move forward. I know some of you are learning new skills, new tasks, um, doing things that maybe are a little bit outside your comfort zone, but that's great because all the good things in life exist outside of our comfort zone. And I'm super excited that you get to expand your knowledge base and uh, your skill set. Uh, the more skills you have, the more, more you're going to get paid. That's just a principle of life. With that being said, um, what I'd like for you to do is commit to one hour of training every single day. Uh, when you log in, uh, make sure that you get an hour of training. Perfect your job. Make sure that you are studying what it is that you're doing, uh, regardless of where you're at in the business or in your life cycle as an employee or anything like that, or a contractor. Make sure that you spend at least one hour a day perfecting your craft. Go out there and get better every single day. I would assert that if you do this on a daily basis, that within a one year's time, you're going to be an absolute expert at what it is that you do. As long as you immerse yourself and commit to training yourself every single day in regards to getting better. So that is my wish for you is that you improve your skill set that you so that you can increase the amount of income that you make, not only today, but for the rest of your life, the more valuable you become, the better your skills are, the more money you are going to make. So uh, what I would like for you to do is I would like to, or what I'd like to do is I'd like to challenge you to before work and or after work, uh, set aside one hour per day in order to improve your skill set and become more valuable, not only to the team, but also to yourself and your future earning potential. So that's all I have for you today. Uh, I'm going to include a link to WooCommerce blocks and uh, how to organize products inside of WooCommerce. Of course, e-commerce is becoming a big part of our business. So I want to make sure that we're all thinking about how to fully maximize the WooCommerce environment for our customers. And when uh, I throw things out there in regards to uh, updating WooCommerce, I want you to be able to communicate with the same terminology as I'm utilizing. So enjoy that training and make it a fantastic day. We'll talk real soon.